All right. Before I uh, cover anything else, I just wanted to post this is my new machine. <laughs> and uh, it's a White's Beach Hunter ID300, straight out of the box. And uh, I also, before I comment anymore, I should say that I even went by the instructions on YouTube. It even shows how to set this five times plus the uh, owner's manual, every setting on here. And the only light on this whole machine that'll work other than when you uh, cut it over on the battery check, this green light will come on. But uh, that's the only time you'll see any other light other than the ring light. But like I say, uh, if you set it up, just like it's on, says on YouTube I'm gonna show you of course this is my my gold wedding ring and of course like I say that that one's the rings now watch the the uh, the iron one is to the left and it don't matter what you run across that thing I detected the whole beach and no coins or iron will ever ring up it's always a middle light Watch this jackhammer, I mean this crowbar. Alright. Coin, it don't matter what kind of coin you run across it. Like I say, I don't know what it is with my luck and machines, but this one detects deep. I was digging quarters at over 12 inches, at least 12. And uh, the only problem is these lights on this thing, they don't work like they're supposed to. And like I said, I tried every trick in the book and uh, it's got some kind of a defect with it. So. I might have to wind up sending this one back to get it switched out, but this is a good machine as far as get, getting deep. But uh, I gotta wonder about my luck. <laughs> anyway, let me go over to find. Alright, I uh, didn't uh, really do the filming today. I was trying to figure this machine out. But like I said, running all metal mode, you're going to get some bottle caps. This is what I dug up. I got 40 bottle caps. And I got six pull tabs. I think I actually got more of those. I just had them in my little scoop in the back of the truck. I think they bounced out. I probably had about probably 12 of those. Some kind of a piece of a jump bracelet or something maybe some kind of surfer bracelet or something some uh, aluminum foil this is like a a uh, part of a battery for a watch evidently I don't know what this is maybe I clean it up I can tell it's rusty it's buried down a ways this here looks like a rivet I think this is uh, some kind of fishing weight I believe of course I got the uh, hair pins <laughs> and of course when you pick up the alcohol wraps it's got a little blood on it so that's real good <laughs> and then some crushed pepper cheap tent steak Cheap uh, costume jewelry that says weights, love, and true. One of the biggest earrings on the man. And of course, I got all my uh, clad. I got uh, nine quarters, six dimes, and 18 pennies. 
and then three nickels and this nickel here was actually stuck to this quarter even when I got home I had to pull apart it's I think it's some wax from a surfboard but uh, that's my fines other than the uh, last fine which was a uh, ring and needless to say it was somebody else's ring and uh, I helped her find it and uh, that's the best I felt you find somebody else's ring it's even better than finding one for yourself and uh, she was panicking and uh, I really enjoyed helping them out and uh, I got her uh, ring back so the rest of the day didn't even count like I say I ain't even sweating my machines messed up or whatever whenever you uh, return somebody's wedding ring I don't think there is a better feeling in the world to be honest with you but anyway I just got this little short clip I, uh, I didn't want to uh, film or everything because you know people in bikinis and all I don't you know some I don't want to be on YouTube but I filmed her hand but anyway hope you enjoyed the short clip it wasn't much I know. <laughs> you know, we're helping I appreciate okay, it okay this is one for uh, lost ring finder <laughs> she lost her ring it was right there so she's happy to get it back oh gosh I'm ecstatic <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much. found it with a new machine all 